then I heard the thunderous boom, and, and I thought the back of the wall f- had fallen off. Long-term resident of the Davenport, Steve France, was watching a movie when part of the apartment building came down on May 28th. I, I get down to the second floor from the fourth floor, and I go around the corner, and the whole hallway was gone. Uh, you know, on the left was laundry, and uh, to the right side was Ryan Hitchcock's apartment, and it was just outdoors. Having lived in the building for 14 years, he's seen owners come and go. I thought things were going to get better with uh, um, Wold taking over, but even the even the sanitary conditions dropped. I mean, it got bad. He'd help out by maintaining the common areas, even though he was handier than most. He says it doesn't take an expert to figure out something was wrong. I'm, I'm not an engineer, but you don't have to be an engineer to know that they should have had some I-beams and, and some sort of welded... Uh, structure inside holding that second floor slab up. As an avid photographer, he's captured Quad City moments like the Blues Fest or others within his own family. I can't work on cars and trucks anymore because I'm, you know, full of arthritis, but uh, I could fix up those old cameras and take them around the block for, a, you know, a shoot, run some film through them. Many of those pictures and vintage equipment now irreplaceable. I think that's the worst stuff. Everything else can be replaced, but certain things are just invalid, you know, they're, they're priceless. Fran says he has a good group of friends supporting him as he looks to rebuild his life. The VA has been absolutely fantastic. It's just going to be a matter of time, you know, five years from now, I'll look back on it. But right now, it's still a little shaky. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.